be scheduled for Thursday night. They played game five on Tuesday, but of course after the boycott led by the Milwaukee Bucks, as Paul George's first shot is good, put the playoffs on hold for three days. Mark, this is your first time on the air since the events of the week. What the players did this week, what did it mean to you? As a former player, I was extremely impressed. Understanding that you get 400 guys in a room. In watching him so much here in the bubble, it seems his defenders are often off balance. He has this tremendous ability to get his defenders off balance. And what you've seen over the last two games is the adjustment to trap him when Zubats is involved. And because of that, as Zubats commits a travel, Park Newton as Hardaway knocks down the jumper, but so much of that credit goes to, you know, truly one of the elite defenses in the NBA. A foul's called on Doncic. That's going to be his first. Hurt against Doncic. You know, he shoulders so much of the burden, and he's starting today on Leonard that it's going to be a challenge. And he's got to be able to stay. Defensively on him in game five back on Tuesday night. He has been brilliant in much of this series. Two triple doubles, the game winner. And there's yet another turnover. Shamit, corner three. That's good. The shoot. He, he did make two. Sometimes, even in a bad game, some good things can happen. Zubats finishes off the penetration. George had 35 points in 25 minutes in game five after that three game slump. Kleba goes up and under. Well defended by Morris. Zubats running the floor but can't handle a pass. Nearly tipped in by Doncic. Rick Carlisle keeps saying, we have to play fast against this team. And Burke. Well, you used to do that with Yao Ming when you coached him in Houston. As Burke misses that, he'd get two quick fouls. You'd leave him in there sometimes. Yeah, I think you do it with a lot of different guys. Smart players can play with fouls. You can't, you can't try to take a shot at me and then compliment me. Yeah, you yeah. can. You can do both. <laughs> Morris with another steal. Leonard, the line drive shot. That won't go. Rebound, Trey Burke to taking the ball out of Leonard's hands in the low post. Hardaway misses Leonard with a rebound. Doncic continues to guard Leonard early, and now it's Klebo who's on him. It was Doncic in Boston. <laughs> like, it was amazing how good these guys were. Kawhi Leonard pulls up, knocks down the jumper. Leonard, his first field goal, his first points. Patience by the Mavericks, taking the double team and being willing passers. And so, they ended up with Lou Williams on Marjanovic. Final seconds here are the first. That won't go. No. And like Coach said, that energy and effort you need when you're talking about winning. Paul George, short rebound to Leonard. Leonard on the foul. Hardaway trying to get on track. He's just one for five to start. That one comes up short. Kawhi Leonard with his fifth rebound. Yes. A good defensive player throughout his career. Tough matchup here for him or anyone. Leonard misses Burke. The rebound amongst the trees is tied. And Carlisle realizing that he was taking advantage of the size goes into a zone. So now the Mavericks change their defense. Leonard spins away, gets in the paint, count it, and one. What a whole new ball game, as we keep saying here in the bubble. Leonard just kind of takes his time, finds his spot, and gets to it. Finishes. And the reason he was annoyed, Mike, is that Marjanovic flipped the screen. Harrell stayed on the wrong side, so they had been blitzing. And again, Doncic's free throw shooting is betraying him here early in this game. So far, two for five from the line. That shot won't go. Marjanovic with the rebound. Doncic, ball knocked loose. Leonard diving on the floor. Gets it in. And a slam dunk there from Jermichael Green. By the way, just for the younger he, guys, he accused the play-by-play play man. No, but th that's the same thing Stan does. I mean, what's, what's oh, going does? on? Yes. Well, I don't know. He's in a lot of fights <laughs> lately. I don't know. Shannon 
Off the dribble, goes right to Doncic, kicks it out, Leonard. Leonard a corner three. Zubats, and a loose ball foul. And there is what you were talking about again, Mark, the ability to decelerate and just stop. He just missed a point-blank shot, but... Jackson misses, but kept alive. Zubats may have gotten some fingertips on it. Shamit inside on an offense. But he is tied up by Zubats. Shot clock at four. Now from the perimeter. Then Smith drives on him. The runner off the glass. To me, Coach, Luka's got to come off that screen with much more pace, forcing the Clippers to make a decision. They're allowed to play him because of the pace in which he's coming off the screen. Yeah, and they're not even trapping him right now. Continue to play a lot of zone. Leonard against Curry. Tough matchup there for Curry. Leonard rattles it home. He's got double figures now. Leonard calling for it. Benny Smith trying to stay with him. Shot clock down to three. Leonard puts up the three. Short rebound to Curry. And at this Mavericks team, Coach, at some point, these guys are going to have to make shots to loosen up the defense against Luke. There's no question they've been a great shooting and great offensive team all year as Leonard knocks in a three. Their second leading score, but do they miss him more defensively or offensively? Definitely on offense as Leonard throws it down. Numbers historically, offensively in the history of the game. Would that mean that people believe that they're the greatest offense in the history of the game? No. Oh, just that the offensive rating was the greatest. Okay. Or the and best. again, so. Are they the best offensive team you've seen since the late 90s? <laughs> Comparison is the thief of joy. I'm not going to. Comparison is the thief of joy. Yeah. <laughs> That's in their spirit. And know that the three-point shot can come back just as quickly as it left them. Leonard sidesteps or actually goes between the two defenders. 23. But to me, it could start with getting a, a string of stops to get your offense going. Shamit from downtown. Inspiring so many. Praying for his family and loved ones. You know, Mike, also want to give a special shout out to the family and friends of Coach Lute Olsen and also Cliff Robinson. Two guys that impacted in, in, in their own way and certainly thinking about their family. And then the Clippers went up by as many as 23 here in the period. George struggles with his dribble. Picked up Leonard. Four to shoot. He does. And misses. George, offensive rebound. He can just get whatever he wants, though. I mean, he missed it, but it just so good. And then Blacks blocks Leonard from behind. Carlisle's already taken two timeouts this quarter, too. So That's still your best play of picking up his four. Leonard, offensive foul. Nice job there from Seth Curry holding his ground. But do we want to reward embellishment? No. All right, then. Just agree with me. <laughs> Doncic has it stripped. Lou Williams the other way. Under three and a half remaining. And the spin move. Kleba with a block, but a foul. And the Mavericks. Really good hands. You know, at this end of the floor is when he struggles a little bit with the pick and roll. That's why Dallas went zone. Curry's pass deflected. Morjanovic takes a tumble. Go inside. Montrez Harrell with a slam. And as we're under two minutes remaining here in this third quarter, Lou Williams hesitated a couple of times, misses. Rebound goes to Doncic. Coming up on a minute left here in the third. Doncic drives, sidestep, layup, count it, and one. Oh, Mark, just like as Leonard goes in. Rebound tip back out. It's how good of organization the Clippers have become versus what they used to be. You played for them in the dark days. How about that shot? The one-hander from Kawhi Leonard. Kawhi Leonard with four to shoot. Goes inside and throws it down with two hands. But this is when you have a great isolation. Hands. Vinny Smith back to Morjanovic. Couple of dribbles. Goes inside. Missed it. Rebound Leonard. 
13 boards for Kawhi Leonard. Very sweet. I think that's like 4D or 5D, <laughs> something like that. You just freestyling right now? I think it is. That's <laughs> Leonard hits another one. Pretty they, good timing to get that initial one. And they inserted him to try to get more size in their zone. Foul call on Hardaway. And then Leonard put it on the floor. It'll be the first team. Leonard against Kleba. Again, Kawhi Leonard. Fifth straight game in this series. He's at 30. And, then, and forcing him to get rid of the basketball. Leonard wants the ball. Hardaway on him again. Fires. Connects Kawhi Leonard. Another intoxicating performance. Five minutes. By the way, Reggie Jackson with nine points here in this fourth quarter. Nine of his 11. Leonard. Zubats to finish. And Jackson trying to draw the charge. Hardaway kicks it out. Good scrambling defense here by the Clippers. Doncic the Euro step. Layup counted and one. This is... Maxi Kleba, way short, and Kawhi Leonard will slow.